We interrupt our regularly scheduled programming for breaking news and now Rainmaker Platform 2.7 dropped today, yo. What's up, minions? This is vlog 35. They said it would never happen, but I'm still here. Hmm. Um, today we're talking some breaking news. Don't worry, I got your back tomorrow, Fred Schenkelberg. I'm totally gonna answer your question. I think you're gonna be stoked with my answer. If you're new to the show, Fred asked the Facebook group how to put together and maintain funnels or a funnel using Rainmaker Platform. So that's what I'm gonna do is break down how to put it together using Rainmaker Platform, put together your funnel for one, one product, one course of products for one customer. What I wanted to touch on real quick was a couple of the key changes. Number one is you can attach autoresponders now to other lists, which is gonna be really helpful. You can also redirect them to a specific landing page. So you sign up for this list, you're added to this autoresponder sequence immediately, and here we redirect you over to this landing page. The idea is you can put tags within that landing page, the system knows to tag that account, that user with a specific tag, and then you're able to suppress or send different well, broadcast emails as well as autoresponder emails based off of that tag, which is really helpful, especially when you're trying to figure out marketing funnels. <laughs> That's the majority of today. I just wanted to let you know, if autoresponder sequences, email is really kicking off, and I think that you'll see a really good example tomorrow uh, when I answer Fred's question because it's going to break down how you can put together a funnel. You know, I want to put together that first funnel and then start explaining it to people and then put it into action on my side and then obviously on client sites and so forth going forward.